Legacy Model VP. Naku, lakad mo. Lakad mo na lang. Lakad mo na to. You know, scatter yeah, burning, thank you. Thank oh. you. The gosh, to get the slow scatter blast to get another slow. Oh, full we'll, we'll coming out from slot and try a lot. Bo Ray's Leo style, the mid laner. That's the same, so yeah, I think it's a, a good matchup against Jakiro. It's great against melee heroes. And now they are going. They want to get to Jakiro. Going in onto the Jakiro Z. Gonna go down here. <laughs> oh, poor Rod. Uh, poor Mike. Yeah, not great. Is it not? But, yes. No, it's still not a good. I'm literally. Let me. I'm gonna try one. Zlatemps. Great cold snap holding last tile off. The raids are coming back. Maybe he will try to go in. Yeah, he let a haze. Another one. And now Zlatemps. What can you do? What can you do, Zlatemps? You are dead, my friend. Yeah, you didn't respect the cool, the low cooldown shadow raids, and now you are gone. You didn't have cold snap anymore because you are red while at top. They are trying to get Kotaro. Kotaro is able to lift. No, great cook. He might snap fire. Now Kotaro is going. Really flash farm with enough mana to get those runes. So uh, I see sliding going for the bottom rune. Prada is doing the same at top lane. Yeah, Jakiro going as well. Yeah, I like what Infamous is doing. I'm Jay-Z. Don't want to last shot of him. Get that rune and they are going. You are back by your mic, still not good. And now they are gonna turn, they are gonna get Jakiro. And now Zladin is gonna try to get a kill. He missed his Sun Strike. Zladin is imps, imps coming. No, he couldn't get Shadow Fin. At least they get the Jenna kill. So not that bad. Nah, Devil don't feel like pushing me. He's like, ah, Jakiro is here. He's really good at pushing. And now they are going for Invoker. Great arena with the Spear and Sun Strike. Vice Path, it's an easy kill. Devil tried to fit in, but he was a little bit too slow doing that. And now Shadow Fiend is completely dead. And Devil would take I do it, my job. No, no, no. Let's not fart things. They're still better than me, that cat. I don't think I'm going to kiss this set up. Yeah. Coming in onto MJZ. I don't like to go with Mental Style against Trent. I, I really don't like it. That's why has a lot of issues against Trent Protect. And now, Snap for Top. Oh, lift. Poor guy. Dra onto the Snap. Fire up, sun strike, cold snap, is dead. Yeah, goodbye snap, free kill for her. Lockdown, they don't have the, the, the means to actually be down and punch them. They get that Aghanim Scepter so they can go in and talk about going out the Invoker, bringing him down in the mid 45 seconds. Oh my, we are clipping again, Rada. But up, they started on Shadow Finn and now his Fire is and he's dead. He couldn't turn on his BKB. Okay, but if he still wants to, to fight, they know the uh, Infamous deals and everything. And now, yeah, at least they got shot of him. Even though Invoker and Rupke died. Oh, down bottom, they sound, they found a play onto Slatim. Slatim's looking for the TP, but he's gonna get rooted. He's gonna get rooted by the tree with the Aghanim Shard. Yeah, and even though two heroes are showing bottom, Infinity is still pressuring mid lane. Without Blink Dagger and Sven, you depend on Mars. And now they want to get Trump. Okay, that's a good kill. That is a good kill indeed, but the Ravage on the backside is oh, good as well. Ravage. The Mortimer Kiss is raining in. It's a double already. And there's going to be the counter with the Arena holding these heroes in. The Spear comes out. And now he's just on the other side. They have nothing to cancel. It's something to defend. Kataro, go with Adrian. And Sven, Sven dying as well here, I think. So, yeah, they are both look at each other. Now they'll try to jump oh, on Templar oh, Assassin. Ice Bath yeah. connection. The Cookie trying to get TA to safety. And they, they, they secure through. Now they rush forward. The Gush out onto MJZ. MJZ fall. Trying to run away. We do have a Ravage available. Can we get EMP? No. So, no be used in this fight. Yeah, but just to make Infamous get out of Triangle is good enough. You'll get a free kill on, on a support and you'll make them go up. As well. But it feels like in the next creep wave or the wave after that, they're just going to be up here three tower and open things up. And now that's going to be the lift. Cookie back, trying to keep the, the alive. Coming forward now onto the Tide Hunter. The Tide Hunter is going to be stunned up with the Ice Path, but Leo Stahl going to drop up on him, forcing people out of the way. A more zoning as well. Oh, oh break it with the overgrowth. It, it's a connects. The tree and making the plays. Slot in goes down. The spear connects onto two. Stunned up. But now they're focusing their attention onto Oscar. Oscar, he's going to pay the piper. Four, four, 
as that's a, a full white. I mean, at least Vayne didn't die, breaking him, and that's right to kill him. Nope, they don't have the damage with that, however, it's about Albert. Nope, they want oh, to get coming in. Sense, they though. drop the Ravage, they rip oh the fin. just no life. Now he's gonna buy back, buy Poker as well. Gonna drop the arena, BKBs though, galore. They're not too worried about Stun Strike, the damage was negligible. The death of the that's that's dieback, GG has... Yeah, man, what, what an easy game for Infinity. Behind to Culvert. I, I think it sucks. Oh, Primal Boost. Primal. Crystal Maiden top, they die. Oh. That, that's an easy kill. Primal Beast against Mirana, yeah, if you can get to, on top of Crystal Maiden, it's really easy to kill her. Problem is getting on top of her, but if you can manage to do that, yeah, free kill. That, that, that's something you, you have, you can kill supports. In bottom lane, it's not that easy to kill Rubik, but yeah, maybe you can. Some network advantage. So yeah, I think that that's what Infamous got. All setting up onto MJZ, the lift, the drag back into the Celestial Starbreaker combo. As it's going to be Devil who picks up the right click. Kataro, he's searching forward. The Fade Bull going to reduce some damage. The Fairy oh. Fire between the two is enough to keep Devil alive. And now the Pendulum swings. They're trying to be aggressive onto Kataro. Focus, Ursa. You can keep on hitting you and you may die. Now they want to go for Nature's Rook. Grasp, Earthshock forward, coming in, Starbreaker oh. lift onto the Ursa. They're going to turn this. Ganek just barely goes down. Thank you to the tree and protector, swinging his big branch. Oh, that's sad. I mean, Ursa had no. Click enough. No, but slots him. He's going to TP his way up here as well as slotting in the area. Try an Racing arrow. forward, oh, the fun. arrow, it connects, it clips onto the Slark, but the Frostbite is there trying to keep the Slark alive, but they just cannot do it. Great arrow by sliding, I mean... Seven. Yeah, he was doing a great job not to try to get Slark before he gets his level 6. And now Prada and now is dead. Slot hims. Prada is dead indeed. Yeah, great job by Infamous. Just, okay, Slark's not level 6, let's pressure him. Now he's really close to level 6, he needs another creep wave. Uh, we got level 6 now, and then, okay, you can farm jungle, you can do whatever you want. Uh, great job by Infamous on the laning stage. Ganek steals Nature's Grasp, but now he's going to be pulverized. Immediately cancelled, but with the arrow connection, they're still going to get the kill onto Ganek. Replaced by Oscar, and he wants to keep on rotating. No, going for a Crystal Maiden. Onslaught. Oh, Parada just dead as a doornail. Oh, the lift. They're trying to find Ganek. Looks like they're the Solar Guardian even coming down. They're using the Pulverize, but it's enough to keep Ganek alive. Oh, but now with the Overgrowth, holding people in place. Slot Sims trying to get himself away. Remedy to the high ground. Oscar with the Onslaught through to get the stun onto Adrian. Adrian, you can tell he's trying to find a target. He just simply cannot find one. Now he's going to throw the ultimate again, trying to find a kill. TP in from the Crystal Maiden. She, this is a prime position for a freezing field. And look at her let and it go. Ripping through the Ursa. As now they're chasing forward. Slot Sims, he has to remnant away. Adrian, he's focusing his attention onto MJZ at the top of your screen. MJZ trying to hide, trying to run. Meanwhile, Devil picks up the kill onto Slot Slot Tim's MJZ now the hunt. He's all eyes are on him and he is going to fall. So a any, any other hero. I think if things go go late, yeah, I really think it's a free game for Slark. I still believe that. But Infam was doing way better than I expected. Way, way better. And props to Oscar. I think it's on his back that they're having such a good game. Oh Prada getting caught with the classic combo. Death of the Crystal Maiden. At least he, got, he countered that warp, so yeah, he's good even Radiant though he died. I think if he just wants to chill right now, I mean, they, they're not feeling great because Legion didn't get many duels, so yeah, not a great game. Oh, and the Pajon Echo, so I think. Uh, actually, I'm not, because Infinity do, does not have that much burst physical damage, so yeah, okay, I buy that, that's a later. Oh, Breaker Devil yeah. getting caught out here. The Pulverize into the Ursa Bear combo. 430 gold going the way of Kataro. Maybe Phoenix tried too much. Oh, no, they're going for a Rubik. 
Oh, they are going for Ruby with the Pounce Connects on to, oh, and they go into the duel, but the overgrowth, making things awkward. That's make that they will not get the kill here. May, or they will not get the, the, the oh god, oh the onslaught, the huge onslaught with the trample just ripping through everyone. Oscar still balling out of control. Adrian has to try to tuck tail and retreat. He is going to get caught by the arrow, the Pounce. Oh, oh. One more right oh, click. That was enough. Not enough. Uh, maybe uh, that's what happened to Infinity. They focused so much on countering infamous heroes. And I, I felt like it was okay, but it's not okay. Right? Infamous was totally right doing that. You, you are way stronger. You have Ursa. Ursa, okay. Even if Ursa only has Battle Fury, you could fight nonstop. It has already Aegis, has Blink Dagger. So, yeah. Uh, how you get any space? You get any space doing that? What, what's Infinity doing? You smoke up and try to find a pickup. Oh, blink forward. But again, the overgrowth. They have the duel. Are they going to get damage for it? They do. The winner, winner, chicken dinner goes to Leah but he immediately pays for it with his life. The Solar Guardian comes in to a li too little, too late. BKB's out from the cores. They're looking to clean up. That's the Dawnbreaker next. The Starbreaker Sun connects on to three, but it's not enough. Triple kill, four slot Timps. And I always like we only. Four man smoke up. On the hunt, no heroes in the area. Leah style Ganek actually. They're both potentially, oh no, the arrow, it's gonna connect. They know with the slight of fist, they know that there's another hero here as well. Leah style, the next to fall. Unstoppable is Slot Tim's. Yeah, what a snow, a great snowball influence is doing here. They scan top, they they saw that they had some heroes there. Yeah, that's Let's see, even with that Oscar to pit top, it's not like uh, Infinite can just run bottom and try to take a fight. Although, they are gonna do it. I mean, I would be afraid if you are Infinite because Ursa is so big, but yeah, maybe that's the call. Yeah, they have vision now on Ursa. Would they try to jump on it? Yeah, good luck. Oh, is Lux coming? Yeah, they got Ursa, but Ursa's just been fighting. And now Duel? Is it a freaking... No! What? what? Why didn't Duel happen? I don't understand what, what happened, but now they have to disengage. Infinity has to run away. Mario Latins get a free kill on Janek, and now looks like probably will be a gunner as well. No, first step. Low ground, and okay, that's fine. He's gonna lose. Seeing he was following the courier, he is going to lead him to Prada. Yeah, free kill. And that's what we expect that would happen, right? I mean, not that we expect Infamous doing this, but when you have this advantage, just put pressure on the map, don't let the enemy farm, keep running from lane to lane, and yeah. but still. They are so far ahead that maybe it is kind of easy. It's like still sitting there, didn't TP yet. Oh, Bullseye, I heard uh, an arrow on Legion Commander. Oh, great job by sliding. And last time we tried to duel. Oh, he wants. Oh, but there's the pulverize. LC being ripped to smithereens in front of our very eyes. It's a massacre. Yeah, what a great arrow from Mirana. I guess Ladin having a great game. Oh, I think all this infamous snowball started with that arrow and slark on top lane early on. That made this possible. And oh. now Ursa is by herself. Inside. Adrian trying to get aggressive here. That is going to be the ultimate though used from Kataro. So no damage done to the fuzzy wuzzy bear. The same cannot be said for Prada. First hit bash, no TP for you, sir. Walking up the high ground indeed. They are... As uh, doesn't seem to be an answer in sight. No, we're going to go for the Blink dual play as well as the Solar Guardian. Do they have enough damage, damage. to bring down this Marana? No dual damage going the way. They don't even get the kill. The kill gets returned onto Leah Style himself. And now but again with the first hit bash. This is the most impressive bashing I've seen. As now coming in with the Remnants. Ganek going to be brought down godlike is Slot Tims. And now on to Prada it goes. Surely GG has to be called soon. This game is coming up all infamous. Yeah, what a song. I think both Infinity and us, we got two tunnel vision by the, those counters that Infinity picked against Infamous, but the draft didn't happen at all. And I honestly think that it was mainly due to the uh, rot Amber rotation top on where they got that Slark kill. Because as soon as you got that Slark kill, well, uh, they are missing AoE control, so. They have just single targets. Uh, meanwhile, down bottom, another go on to Oscar. Oscar brought down fairly low, and that's first blood. Go in the way of Adrian. Uh, a good thing about this safe lane is that Downbreaker level 2 spike is nothing against OD. You, 
can always just uh, astro onto the new tech which will take over the entirety of the lima major meanwhile snapfire being overtaken by himself by oscar picking up the final kill a power shot did a lot of damage there from the windrunner yeah free kill Be aggressive oh for devil oh devil Got hit with the root. Here comes Ganek coming in, trying to support his boy. The Boundless Strike connects onto Katara. Katara gonna pop the Fairy Fire, still chasing forward onto Devil. Whirling Axes, Flaming Spirits. Devil looking like he's gonna go down, and he does. But Ganek trying to find Katara so that he can get the return kill. Now he's gonna turn his attention okay, back to mid. Uh, that's really good for Amber Spirit. Even though he went for the Flame Guard level at his level 2, he didn't get dove by, by Bat Rider, and now he's Gucci. Now he's going in. Oh, Gucci is going to be going in, slotted with the, with the help of the Shackle Shot that does connect. That's going to be the Firefly trying to get away his Leo style, but dancing on him with the Remnants. No escape in. Amber can survive, but I never see it happening. He just dies. And oh, now Chase going, going on to Adrian. Shackle Shot is going to connect. Celestial Hammer, Starbreaker gets canceled by the Astral Imprisonment. TP coming in from the. Uh, oh, we're even going to drop the. Drop the hammer, but it's not enough. They are only going to be able to get the kill onto one. The Scatter Blast, though. They might be trying to turn this around. Fairy Fire, Slide of Fist, Slot Zims. He's going to get away. Meanwhile, up at the top lane, they found a kill onto Ganek. Slide of Fist, Chains, Combo. Do they have the ability to dive? It almost looks like Oscar wants to. He's thinking as the Beastmaster just playing with the star sense. Oh no, is Greed gonna make him pay the Pied Piper? Oh, the lasso, it connects. Solar Guardian gonna be coming down right on top of his head, just cutting through the Beastmaster. Slot Tims is on a killing spree. Yeah, I think that's exactly how you play against Beastmaster. After he gets the first tower, don't let him free fire. Yes, so use his ultimate so, so he could dodge with his ultimate and not let Beastmaster run away. Now oh, Oscar may be a little bit too far from home. Oh, that's a Wukong's flame break pushback does connect. Scatter blast to slow the cookie to get him ahead. The lasso sunray trying to keep the the dawnbreaker alive, but the damage it's too significant. But here comes Slatems with the counter play. The egg it's on the field. Little shredder to immediately scramble that egg. Kataro though coming in gets the root onto the snapfire. Big hero. Mm. So yeah, the game is slow because this master can't do anything. Oh, Boundless, oh, Mortimer Kisses coming in. Roshan fight indeed. Wukong's command. Here comes Leo style. He has the lasso Not trying Aegis. to hold him in place. He got the Aegis of the Immortal. Snatched that mug. The Phoenix Egg going to be on the field. The little Shredder. Are they going to be able to pop the egg? No. The Supernova. It's looking like it's going to pop. It goes off. It stuns two. There's going to be the Astral or the, the Hammer drop from the OD. Only two have fallen in this fight. Buyback from the Windrunner. Icarus Dive trying to get away. MJZ. Power shot from afar. But okay, that's a that's a good little fight for oh, Infinity. Or shackle. it was the two the two hero shackle shot. Slatim's coming around from the backside. It's gonna be the Aegis that pops. Hurricane bike push it out. Oh, look at the damage coming through from the OD. Oh my! The shackle shot. Oh, was Yules on the MJZ. And he's dead as well. A great fight for Infinity. Really great. Even though that the shackle shot was so great. Maybe Monkey King will break that smoke. Yeah, he did. Yeah, that's good enough for Infinity. Oh, Slide of Fist combos. The Gale Force wins a blow in holding this Monkey King in place. As they are going to be able to be get a pick for their smoke positioning. Yeah, that's okay for him. He's not afraid of OD. Oh, the blink, the lasso, they found the ember, trying to use the sunray to keep him alive, as well as the solar guardian. Oh, is it enough? No, they drop the hammer and rip through him. The the egg is gonna be is going to be cooked as well. Now the Mortimer Kiss is raining down. Oscar, this fight is coming up all infinity. And that's OD for you. That ember was going to survive. He was so alive, but then OD drops the hammer and he's a goner. He almost survived actually, because Five-man smoke. They're going into the Roshan pit, but there's nobody around. The power shot is going to scout things out. Now that we're going to go up to the high ground, we're going to have a tip. BKB coming out from all the cores, but the Lotus, the the, the Lotus reflects back the 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 lasso as uh, the Leo Style is going to get chased up onto the cliff. He is going to go down the gym. They will not be able to see that. Adrian thinking about coming forward. Ganek in the area as well. Oh, oh but Lotus. the Lotus. 
the Lotus reflects back the Astral Imprisonment as now the focus coming in onto Oscar. Oscar, he's able to get to the other side of the Wukong. We need one more right click to bring him down. The Hex, the right click, it's there. Adrian, 1,000 net worth at what feels like for the last couple of minutes. And now this OD, who was at 20, now has exploded out to almost 24. Oh, a play late. setting up. Monkey King. Monkey King. He, he should be going down here, you would think. The Solar Guardian's starting to come in. Here comes the bat or the, the OD, though. They want to take this fight. The Lasso pulling back the Troll Warlord into the into the Primal Roar. They are able to pop the Aegis. The ultimate does come off from the Troll Warlord, so it's going to take a while to kill him. The Yule Scepter is going to pop up. Adrian, what can you do here? A good Shackle Shot makes it so Adrian can't do nothing, but they are still able to run down the Troll Warlord. The chase continues. The Flame Break pushback onto Slotted. Boundless Strike, hold him in place. Adrian coming up, Devil with the Whirling Axes, picks up the kill. And thank God OD had that Aegis. Oh. Yeah, it hurts a lot. Oh, the siege continues. Gapepe, I'm gonna have to leave you again. I will be right back. Okay, go for it, man. Now OD's diving, he wants to get down breaker. He's jumping on down breaker. Genek missed this sun, but that's fine. Now they last the Amber, and look at the burst that OD brings to the table. Oh my, Amber is just dead. If you don't turn on his BKB, he dies so easily against OD. And now Oscar trying to fight back, but you can't do it. Even with Phoenix, Sun, Phoenix Sunray. And now it looks like it will be easy wreck. Man, they really want to get aggressive. Not quite able to connect on the Boundless Strike. That was so close. But now they are going to find the Windrunner. Bring her back with the Lasso. Find the easy pick. Get the easy pick. 50 seconds of, fi of power play Dota. Yeah, too bad they used that Lasso. OD had already used his Vice. So yeah, not great, but still. That's fine. OD has BK, uh, BKB. No, I mean, he has BKB. But he has DD. And with the Moon Shard, it's pretty easy to push those towers. OD even blinking aggressively here, but you can see just how much how much pushing power this lineup has, as that's going to be a lane of barracks to fall. They're going to start pivoting their way towards the top lane. And really, what sort of answer does Infamous have for this aggression? Adrian, oh my goodness gracious, he's going to oh, blink right in, use the Hextic, bring down the Ember, the four staff, pushes him back to safety. BKB is almost out, so the Cookie gets him out of the base. Now they're going to turn their aggression onto Ganek. Ganek just bouncing on his pole, doing A-OK. -okay. Got to get the four staff to safety. That They're running as uh, they are the, the official, org uh, whatever, they're, 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 they're sponsoring the, the SA yeah. Dota scene, guys. So, so show some love is all I'm trying to it. say. Hurricane Pike, for, force back. Oh, there's a oh, lasso, lasso up onto the high ground. They get the lasso onto the troll. They pop the Lincolns. Reflect back onto the soul, onto the, the primal roar. But all oh, with the Sanity's Jeez, Eclipse. Uh, just able to bring down the troll warlord. They're bringing down everybody. And I think that's just the game, Capepe. Yeah, that's game for you. A great start from Breath Rider. Didn't have the greatest early game, but yeah, when it needed with that Blink Dagger. First that fight uh, on River getting the Amber, now getting the troll. No buyback. Easy GG. Right.